Welcome guys, welcome back to Mutants Genetic Gladiators. It's me, Piggy Game here, as always. And yes, welcome back guys. So, let's check the daily, not challenges, daily post. Oh, okay, so in the mutant slots, they've got the super spin available. Multiple, multiply your rewards. Interesting, might check that out. We've got stars on for sale, buy one, get two free, which it's they've done before. Oh, and here we go, guys. 20 legendary mutants now breedable. Now I've um, I've done a comment to ask whether this is a permanent event or a limited time event, and I've not let uh, they have not let me know yet. But I'll let you know uh, or if I find out before uploading this video. I'll put a little note on the video saying it is or it isn't. But yeah, that's exciting. We're going to try and do one, maybe two of those today, if at all possible. And we've seen this girl, gal on sale. Let me turn off the music. There we go. Oops, I reset it. There we go. Okay, so I know this is one combination to get a legendary mutant. I don't know which one. Let me just collect all my coinage. There we go. I've now got this guy, just so you know, up to level... 22 um, so everyone that I really care about I haven't worked on this guy because there's no platinum version for him so I'm just debating whether to level him up or not uh, I've collected my gold yes I have let's collect the med packs and get it started again there we go okay so let's see first of all if we get a legendary mutant from this so I pre-did this when I saw that. I looked up a recipe. Well, on the comments, people do mention recipes. Oh, and um, well, before I do, guys, so the 20, 20 mutants that are available, I'm going to put on screen now. I'm going to go one at a time. I'm going to blank out the screen, and I'm going to put the pictures on there. You're probably seeing it right now. So those are the mutants that are available to breed. I don't know if it's a specific breed, so you have to breed one mutant with another that are that are just those mutants so so let's just say a robot and um a beast so you only have to breed them to get that mutant or whether it's just to do with the geno i have a feeling it's just to do with the geno so uh like one of the there's a robot um legendary mutant there that is a robot and a warrior so is that all you need to do mix to mix a robot and a warrior gene together and you get it i don't know but anyway so hopefully hopefully uh, this is enough time of me talking with the pictures going up on screen so we're back now <laughs> god it's so hard to determine how long to to wait there it's only four pictures so shouldn't be too long but anyway guys so we're gonna see what we get from this oh please come on be good to your picky gamer he's so tall Yes, rare mutant, and there we go. We've got the Diz, uh, what is it, Dzing, Dzinger. <laughs> so yeah, that's and this is the what I've um, match guys. Obviously, the robot and the warrior gene has mixed it there to make this guy. So let's let's keep him sweet. How long is it gonna take? It's going to take three hours. I don't want to spend gold because I want to try and get, obviously, another gold furnace. Now, the next mutants that I want to breed is the little kitty. Let's just give him some of that. And I'll breed the robot again. Give you two of that so I can breed you. Okay, so it was... Robot and the little kitty cat um no i'm not going to chuck in a bronze star because i'm using them to get the silver to get gold just can't wait to use those ones so i'm just going to crossbreed them now so this robot i know uh can become platinum and i'm sorry like two episodes ago i was saying oh you can get this in i was meant to say platinum but i said bronze constantly <laughs> so just so you guys know and you're going to take 
I don't want to waste 24 gold. Uh, let's check out to see to see this. Super spin times two, 20 gold. Well, isn't that just... Look at how much tokens I've got, 173. Ugh. Is it worth it? Should I just spin it once? Let's spin it once. Ah, for you guys. It's going to be crap anyway. Yes, money. Times two. Oh, yay. So, unless you've got gold galore coming out of your butt, it's, I don't think it's worth it. Um, so, yeah, and time two as well works on the mutants, but you'd really want it on that and that. Are really the only things, really, that you'd want. Like, two mutants, you're not going to use them. You're going to, like, maybe two silvers, but still you're not going to take two of them into battle. And if you get two of the witches, well, it doesn't matter, because you've got to make them gold anyway. I, I, I don't see too much of a point, rather than getting the rare stuff of this and the gold, that's the only... Like, yeah, getting those are okay, but not worth 20 gold. So that's the mutant slot. So, do we have a reactor token? Oh, yes, we've got three reactor tokens. Oh, no, this needs four. Bummer. Uh, there is a new time soldier one. Not as good as the other one, but you get an opportunity to platinum there. Obviously, get them all. You get this guy. And you've got other, other things here, which are pretty handy. Only cost three. I could do that, but I want to stick with this one until it ends. So, today's episode, guys... I'm going to be continuing on the campaign, and then we might do a couple of um, PvP matches. I'm going to do a video on uh, this Colosseum 2, the Colosseum New Romeo, <laughs> uh, to try and see how far I can go, because, you know, that's, that's not a bad mutant to get it, and I want to see how high I can get. So, okay, let's continue the campaign. We'll stay in the beta division, and we'll continue on so I want to choose fast mutants which are you you what are you you're 4.7 you're not that fast it was the goat bastard wasn't it I'm pretty sure it was the goat bastard yeah okay yeah because he's very slow he's okay but very slow so you know you may want to take him into the PvP and then too fast like this this may be a good combination these three okay Let's get, let's get it on. Uh, let's use a tag partner. I'll go down to 40. 42 and onwards. Fight. Oh, I'll, I'll actually use um, one of my tag partners that I know watches my videos. Nelson, I believe Fight. it is. Fight. Okay, so... She gets to attack first. Let's use our tag partner to kill her. Ooh, that's a nice legendary there. Kablamo! Okay, so she's going to be dead. I don't think you can kill... Oh, you might be able to. Yeah, you can. Nice. Just. And then the goop bastard can... Yes, critical hit. Dead in one. It would have taken two, but I could have easily done it. No level ups because I'm maxed out. Fame, yes, okay, so we're just continuing on as we go, getting to see some mutants as well, just loads it down there. The Parasite Queen, I think, I'm not sure. But, yeah, that's a beast in a galaxy. It's fast mutant, but, again, you breed that normally. It's not a legendary or anything like that, so it's not worth noting. And even these guys, not worth noting. These are basic mutants, not legendary. I don't, let's, like I said, let's use Nelson. Where's Nelson? How high are you, Nelson? Have I gone past you? Whoa, 68. Nice. What mutant have you got for me? Fight. Fight. So we're going to have to use him straight away. Jeez, oh, weak against both. Ooh, 
Ooh, it uh, looks like he got that from the reactor token. Nice, that's a good, good tag. Good tag, that one. Now, let's take this guy out easily. What is my tag? My tag should be that, um, the, the latest mutant that I put up to 22, which isn't a bad mutant. Okay, so we're gonna... We'll get the goat to take her out, so we'll just take him on. So I'm pretty sure she's going to have to... Oh yeah, she could have probably taken him out one hit. 280. Yeah, she could have taken him out in one hit. Goat to take her. Should kill her in one. Yep. And continuing on with the next round. Sorry about that, guys. Little, little stop of the gameplay on the um, web page. Nothing much I can do. Had to redo the last event. Didn't want to show you that. <laughs> you, saw, you saw one attempt, but oh well. Continuing on... Uh, go back down, select you, and we'll continue on, I'm hoping to get this, um, Fight. this, this part <laughs> out of the way with, I'll, I'll explain to you down the track, I don't think I'll need to use the tag parts for these guys, there's one hit there, She can do more damage with this. One more hit and he's dead. Now, I think it's better off if this guy does the attack on him. And then he can finish off this one. Dead. And then he gets another attack on him. Yep, and she's going to get attacked, so... Oh, was that a critical? Oh, that, no, that was just the boost, so yeah. Sweet. Oh, and there we go. Didn't even need to use him to get the energy fill. Got a nice boost still, still on for a day, I think. Here comes the boss. Now we'll need to use a tag for this. Let's select our team. We will validate and we're going to use a high person. Let's... I've got this 315. Let's just use... use him. He'll, he'll probably be dead in one hit. Check this out. Uh, you're good against that. So tag. There you go. Wow. Ooh, no, not, not quite dead, but a lot of damage. Ooh, you get the boost effect. Uh, this on you. And all this, this curse is going to... Like, yes, he gets two boosts, which is 60%. Stacked twice. He gets cursed by 810. Um... So it stacks. That stacks more. That can only st stack two times. And look at this. He won't, he won't get an attack. I'm pretty sure I'm going to kill him before he gets an attack. But the curse keeps on. Oh no, he gets a bleed effect, not a curse. And then he gets another hit. So even if this guy does get a hit, he's going to be cursed three times. So yes, he gets 60% boost, but already he's going to be down 1,244. But this attack's going to kill him, unfortunately. <laughs> it's good when you can get them down to the point where they only do 20 or 100 damage. Okay, so that's this little area done. I get a silver star for that. And then it opens up uh, the next one. Blood Flooded Fields. We get a reactor token if we complete this one. Down the track we get a double XP, not not important, but we get a get a mutant here, which is gonna be cool. Um, then Delta, then we can go to the Delta Division and continue this on into the Omega Division where they're pretty much gold mutants. It's these are like these are 
um, identical, the alpha, beta, delta, and omega divisions. They're all identical, except that's just the normal mutants. That's them with bronze, that's them with silver, that's them with gold. And then you get legendary mutants, and then I've never made it to the mega division yet. But yeah, so that's that. Um, got tickets to continue, but not too much more. Let's do a couple of PvP tournaments, shall we? Load up. Okay, so I've only done two attacks. I'm in the top 20. We can attack more. This is my team that will, is defending me. Um, do I need a request help? No, I've got plenty of people defending me. Um, tournament board. Okay, so I'm just going to go for speed. Hmm. Yeah, we can take this guy on fight. Let's use a higher person. Let's go to 80 and go on. Wow. You, you basically fight people with just legendaries. Wow. Um, okay, let's take... Let's concentrate on getting you out because you're the fastest. That should kill him. Sweet! Oh. Um, you're good against these two. Beast is secondary good. So either way, I'm screwed. We'll concentrate on him next anyway. Uh, you're weak against him, aren't you? I don't know. Let, let's, let's do this. Hopefully we'll be able to kill him. Ooh, retaliate. I hate retaliate. Okay, um... Beast is bad. Weak against that, so we got to use this on him. Give him a bleed effect. He's going to retaliate. But the curse also affects, affects the retaliate as well. These are bad. Actually, I'm going to let him hit. I'm going to do a hit on him. Because he doesn't retaliate. He's just curse as well. Oh, damn it. They must have given him a little... If I go over here and see, they've given him a little retaliate boost. Oh, and this guy's a curse boost as well. So he gets retaliate, curse. Ugh. Okay, we'll just continue on this guy. Too bad I didn't get a critical. That would have killed him, but two curse on him is going to really affect his stats. Yeah, he's a weak guy, so he's a, he, he gets killed very easily, unfortunately. I'm going to get a move before this guy. Sweet, so I'm going to kill him with her. And use the bucking ball. Get a little retaliation back. Yeah, I've got this one in the bag. And you should be able to kill him. Sweet. So yeah, this is all I do in the in the world in the world tournament in the PvP tweetment. Uh let's do another one, shall we? Um you you let's give you energy back. We use four, give her health up. One, two, three, four, five, and give me ten. And how much were you at? One and two. So there we go. This one might be a bit more tougher, but we're going to do it. Uh, we'll use this person. Fight. Fight. Again, slow. I say this is why I say speed. Speed. Speed power. Okay, um... Let's check this. Okay, so he gets a shield bonus, shield bonus, and nothing. So let's go after this guy first. Use the tag. On you. Hopefully you can kill him. Ooh, he's a nice guy. Um, that's dead. Sweet! 
Okay, then we're going to take this guy out because he's the next fastest. Oh, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Uh, da, 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 da. Yep. Uh, but you get to attack next, so I have to attack you. Yeah, he wouldn't have been able to do it on his own. I had to attack him twice here. And then we get to hit him with two more curses. He gets a shield, I think I said. Yeah, so that doesn't really affect us. Um, that's super weak. This is the least weakest. So even though it's weak, the curse is still going to affect him. And you get to curse him, but you get a better attack. Oh, critical, and he's dead. Yes! So all without touching me. That's why I favor speed, guys. Let me know what you... Guys, let me know in the comments. What do you think of my team? What's your strategy? Do you like the speed? Do you like the slower guys with the power? Let, let me know. I'm interested to know. I've always... Well, not always. When I start, you when you first start off, you, you don't know really what you're doing. <laughs> but, um, yeah, once I knew what I was doing and being a pro and all at this now, I consider myself a pro. Uh... Yeah, let's see, I've already got you. Don't need 100 tokens. You're okay, but probably not worth 200. Um, oh yeah, there, there's this event on with the crossbreeding and stuff like that. So, you know, I can earn some challenge tokens. Because I wouldn't mind getting a few challenge tokens to be able to get this mutant. Maybe. Like, it's two, two um, cyber genes. Geno, so, don't know. Maybe go for the gold stars. Who knows? But um, yeah, let me know in the comments, guy, what you, what you think. What's your strategy? Is it the speed to attack first and use your tag? That's my that's my strategy all the time in PvP. And even when you have, um, I have quite a few recruits defending me, uh, and I you know I've got two speedsters there, so I normally get the first attack. So and then I use the the help first so that that's my strategy let me know what you guys think down in the comments below what's your strategy um yeah so i'm going to concentrate on on this event a bit more since it's only got two days to go because i wouldn't mind getting this mutant shouldn't be too difficult for me i only have to do top 15 i don't think it's top 10 and uh yeah we could just got let's daily challenge collect kill seven uh accelerate uh, i could we we'll possibly get that done, maybe. We'll just collect this one, get a challenge token and curse. Okay, so thank you so much, guys, for watching in this episode. I wonder if I'm going to get a good mutant out of this. <laughs> if if a lot of people followed me on Twitter, I'd start posting up things like that. I don't know. I probably will. You know, look on Twitter. I'll, I'll post. I'll post what I get. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for joining me on this episode, and I'll see you all next time. Bye!